In this video, we're going to install SQL Server 2019 Developer Edition. So we're going to search for SQL Server 2019 download. Click on the download page. We're going to have a few options and your page might look different than my download page, but what you're going to want to look for is the Developer Edition. So we're going to download this and wait for the download. We'll open our download. And now we're going to want to choose a basic install. So we'll accept the terms and click install. This installation takes about five to 10 minutes. So I'm going to pause the video and skip ahead. Our installation is almost complete. This whole process just take about five to 10 minutes for this part. And now we're going to install SQL Server Management Studio. So at the bottom, it's going to be install SSMS. You're going to click that. It'll bring you to a download page. And now you're going to want to just select download SQL Server Management Studio. We're going to want to close our previous installation screen. And now I'm going to try to run. Our setup that we downloaded, but it's giving me a restart message. So I have to restart. Um, maybe you won't have to restart, but I will restart and come back. And now I am back and you're going to run again as administrator. You're going to click install and this should take some time. So I'm going to pause the video again and skip ahead. Setup is complete. Close and now you should be able to search for SQL Server Management Studio. Open it. Should take a little bit of time, and now you can see you have you should have Windows authentication, and you can connect, but you will not have any databases that you can use. But you now have a SQL Server installation. 